I'm very happy that this day has finally come. I didn't expect like for us to be together the first time we met. When I first met her, I said, mm, this girl is very cute and she's very pretty. I just want to ask directions, but yeah. Of course, I choose a pretty girl for directions, right? Probably it's fate and God's will that she brought us together. I mean, I never expected to be with a guy like him. Ultimately, I'll ask for directions, but since if I have a number, why not? Actually, I don't really know what came over me because I don't really give my phone number to strangers, especially if it's a guy. <laughs> yeah, but on that day, I guess um, it was just the feeling at that moment that uh, made me sort of like uh, give my number to him. Yes, I got a number! That's how we you know, actually managed to like, maintain it. Contact. We've been together for so long and we've known each other for you know like almost 10 years. Change me from a very Mandarin speaking person to a very English speaking person. At the same time I have mellowed down my temper and I tend to be more patient towards things around me, people around me. We've been to like places like you know Europe, but you know moving forward probably we want to go to somewhere which is like less city like but more you know towards nature so we can also uh, you know embrace the nature. Yeah. We always wanted to go to Northern Lights. Yeah, that was uh, our dream destination because uh, we feel that it's a very uh, surreal, surreal place and it's also very magical and you know neither of us have been there before. And we go around, we can really truly appreciate the aura, the place, and, and just see the northern lights together. Yeah. Something very natural. He's sincere, he's genuine. Um, I can actually be myself when I'm with him. And, uh, and I, I don't need to worry about, like, you know, how I look, whether, you know, whether my makeup is ruined. Because basically, I think that um, he lets me for who I am. Most importantly, I think I appreciate um, small little things in life before long. I think without him, um, I won't be who I am today. This year is a very eventful year. And in my best capacity, I would like to give Nicole the very best that I can have for her. I believe that uh, from the start that he was he's actually the chosen one and no one else can actually replace him. So. Like even when I go or like you know, I have no teeth, I, I, I feel that you know it's still someone that I can uh, count on and depend on to spend the rest of my life with. Yeah. I really want to thank her for being with me and choose me as her husband. Faith, hope and love, all of which love is the greatest of all.